When Law told his superior that he had never killed anyone, the man questioned whether Law could cut his heart off from the enemy. Within the paranoid and distrustful atmosphere that pervaded DK, Democratic Kampuchea, any questions about a person's loyalty to the party could result in accusations that he or she was an enemy. If Law did not kill in this situation, he could have been accused of being a traitor, as Law explained. I was afraid they would suspect me until they saw me kill with their own eyes, until they saw that I could cut off my heart and kill, as opposed to viewing the actions of such people within fields of constraints and inducements that are operative under a violent regime. Individuals who commit murderous acts are usually not just coerced into doing so. They are often motivated by pre-existing cultural models that are ideologically or individually adapted to the genocidal situation. Why did you kill? The Cambodian genocide and the dark side of face and honor Alexander Laban Hintron, the Journal of Asian Studies 57, number 1, February, 1998, 93-122.